Today's trouble is enough for today. Matthew chapter 6 and verse 34. So don't worry about tomorrow, for tomorrow will bring its own worries. Today's trouble is enough for today. Worrying has become part of human life, and some worry so much while others who do not worry about anything at all. Both extremes are not good. Jesus knew the reality of life issues and taught us people not to worry too much since by doing so we cannot alter anything around it. Nevertheless, people have not given up worrying. William Marshall in his article, Eternity Shut in a Span, quips about a woman, Do lend your ears as I read it for you. For several years, a woman had been having trouble getting to sleep at night because she feared burglars. One night her husband heard a noise in the house so he went downstairs to investigate when he got there he did find a burglar good evening said the man of the house i am pleased to see you come upstairs and meet my wife she has been waiting 10 years to meet you i'm sure you have left a little bit with worrying this is what happens we worry about something that may not happen at all worry is faith in the negative trust in the unpleasant assurance of disaster and belief in defeat worrying is wasting today's time to clutter up tomorrow's opportunities with yesterday's troubles therefore do not worry about anything put your trust in the lord and carry on he knows all your troubles and he's just a call away call him during your crisis and he will be there to rescue today's trouble is enough for today amen